to go live, live, live. <laughs> We're going live on YouTube Live because it's Friday and it's Toya and it's Bella and we're live on YouTube Live. It's Toya and Bella live. You ready for Toya and Bella live? Yes. All right. What's up, Fabs and Besties? You are watching YouTube Live with Toya and Bella. Mr. Bowie is still in training. He's in the house, actually, but you know, we're working on him on learning how to become a uh, YouTuber, you know, one who can sit and chill without e eating our faces off. So uh, when he's better, he will be back. <laughs> so, but today we are so excited because we are making a flower wall. It is spring turning into summer. And all I can think about is flowers because all the flowers in my yard are blooming right now. And on Pinterest, I have a whole board filled with just flower walls because I think they're amazing. One of my um, Studio Muchi, another amazing YouTuber, or I mean, is she a YouTuber? I don't know. Well, she's an influencer and she has this beautiful flower wall in her apartment at one time. So that's what we're making today. We're making a flower wall. For this project, you need some uh, artificial plants. I got mine from the dollar store and you want to try to find small ones. Although sometimes if the flowers are large, that can look amazing too. I went for the smallest flowers I could find at my Dollar Tree, which are these. I would have preferred something more like a rose, just saying, but you work with what you got. Then you also are going to need poster board or foam board or cardboard. Now that is what you're going to glue your flowers to or poke them into and that's going to make your wall. What I did is I used foam board because you know I love my foam board and I made one of our doll stands where we just put a base on the bottom. Oh that is destroying my white balance. Okay, here we go. So I put a base on the bottom and a board on the top that is taller than my doll. What's good about foam board is that you don't even need glue. All you need to do is have something like a stylist or a dotting tool or crochet needle. Crochet needle. Did I scratch you? Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> or a crochet needle. You can make a little hole in the foam, take the little flower and push it in and just keep covering it until it's done. All right, so those are the instructions. We're gonna go ahead and start crafting and answering all of your questions and you can craft along with us at home and hopefully our flower walls will be done by the end of this live, which is about one hour. Okay, here we go. What's up to Jada? How you doing? What's up to James? How you doing? It just got quiet, man. Sorry, I'm read <laughs> I was reading the comments. Okay, so I'm gonna destroy my white balance again just to show you exactly what I'm doing. So here is my dotting tool. I have foam board. You just push a little hole into the foam board. Take the flower bud with a little plastic insert right off of the artificial stem. And then you're gonna push it into, okay, don't use the dotting tool. Use a crochet hook. Cause that's what I used earlier. Makes a larger hole. And then we just push that in and your flower is facing forward, no glue, and it stays. The plus side of using a no glue option is that you can change out the flowers for different seasons. Eh? Now, when we're talking colors of those flowers, I personally love a monochromatic look. It's not what I'm doing today, but I love a monochromatic look. If you're doing monochromatic, like all pink or all purple or all blue, you don't need the leaves. If you're gonna do something that's a lot of different colors, you are gonna want those leaves. Keep that in mind. All right, I'm gonna be over here doing this while you're gonna start answering those questions. Okay. Can you do a video game themed room? What type of video game? We have, we have a Fortnite room. We have a uh, Minecraft room. So which video game, like she said, are you interested in? Because we do have those video game themed rooms out and we did Animal Crossing. So it's like three man and we made a room for dolls who are gamers. That's eh? four. Eh? What's the next question? Um, you should make a photo shoot. A photo shoot, like, um, would define that. So if you're looking for crafting on the go doll photography tips, we do have a couple of videos for that. I do have plans to make some more as soon as my grass turns green, which it's doing right now. And we also have a doll photography studio DIY out there so that your dolls can be the ones who are taking the photos of other dolls. You gotta be faster with these questions. Sorry, right? I'm so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like white space. Okay, uh. So, uh 
someone said you guys are my favorite youtubers because i love your dark creation and like how you make your dorms and all that stuff oh thank, thank you, you. Thank do you, you like slime i used to be obsessed with it back in like when it was huge yes remember that we made a slime when elmer's room. went like we're gonna make gallon size glue bottle like glue bottles there's slime. i never actually got a gallon of glue no but i just recently found one of her old slime containers and it has hardened to a very hard acrylic type texture it was crazy but we haven't done slime lately because uh i used to watch youtube videos and like just obsessed with it just totally obsessed i remember it was in middle school and people would bring slime to school and get in a ton of trouble you know, we do have um, slime kitchen videos where the dolls are using slime to make food. So those videos are on YouTube. Add my faggot stuff. I'm not plugging, but I am plugging. Hi, Paxton. <laughs> Why doesn't Bella have glasses? Bella decided to get contacts. Yes. I wear glasses every other day of the week. Just when I'm on the camera, I just put contacts in. Yeah. Yeah. I also want to start wearing sunglasses, but I don't own a pair of sunglasses because I never had to wear them. So I we tried the transition glasses at one time. It's just that they would always transition indoors. And <laughs> sometimes that would happen. We'd be like on a shoot or filming and our glasses would just turn dark in the middle. And so yeah. it's just like, all right, we can't do that. So yeah. Um You should find the next question before I'm done talking. I know, I Shout out to do Abby! You, do you play Minecraft? I used to play a ton of Minecraft. I used to play a ton of video games. But over the years, my attention span has dwindled to zero. So I played Genshin Impact the other day on my brother's account, and like, I got so angry so fast. <laughs> <laughs> like gamer rage. I don't know what it is. The only game I can really stand to play is Sims. That's right. She does play Sims. I don't play a ton anymore. But I do play it. Well, we were thinking about starting some Sims gameplay, and we do have. Yeah, um, that's why I do want to do videos about it, so then it will force me to play it because I do think it's super cool. And I like playing it. I just ha don't cannot find the reason to at the moment. Well, we do have a Roblox video that we're going to be shooting real soon, so yeah. you'll be playing in that. I used to play one. so much Roblox. I used to play I so know. much video, so many video games. All right, get ready for the white balance to be thrown off. So what I did first was start with one color. I went ahead and added a whole bunch of pink on. Now I'm going to go with a different color and add that sporadically to try to get my cover colors a little even. You know what you like doing? You like pulling the flowers off. So you are more than welcome to pull the flowers oh, off really? of this. Yes, but you need to keep this part on. Because I know you like to just tear stuff up. But <laughs> you can just keep like that this. part. Yes, there okay. you go. Just put a pile. All right. Oh, wow, they're going so fast. What's up, Claire? How you doing? Okay. Can you make a glam bedroom? A glam bedroom. Yes. I can do totally do a glam bedroom. Um, I'm totally in love right now with our hidden doll rooms. Can you pick one color and just stick with one color first? What color are you doing? Because I just got one, one of I these. I did. Okay, so you're doing purples. Thing. Okay, do purple. Okay. Yes, we can do a glam bedroom. Um, we did make a pretty cool looking Cinderella inspired bed a while back but as for a full bedroom that's like I guess gold and glittery yeah we can totally do that I don't know what colors I would want to do though I'm kind of like a I feel like that's a rose gold it calls for rose gold for some reason I, I say diamondy like silver and and silver and white oh really I'm thinking and gray rose gold. but those are like the colors I love so oh yeah you think what see one job to do keep a little it did it by itself <laughs> <laughs> Not me yelling at her for pulling the flowers off wrong. What's up, Victoria? How you doing? Um, make a Harry Potter vid. Uh, well, our video coming out tomorrow has a Harry Potter thing in it. So does that count? And Can we I do have off of this? no. That's all I needed. And we do have a Harry Potter mashup. We do have Harry Potter unboxings with Harry Potter mini rooms. We've made wands. We've made a wand shop. We've made all kinds of Harry Potter things. So you might want to check out the play, um, the mashup, and see if we've already covered some of the things that you might be looking for. Someone said, um, "Do you have any squishmallows?" 
If, yes. you, if you don't, you should get some because they're cute. So what I did with all of my Squishmallows, because I went through a Squishmallow phase. Okay? Yeah, like we would go to Walgreens <laughs> just to get them. It, I hate going into Walgreens, but we that like every day. It was so bad after school. I had to get Squishmallows, and I had so many you couldn't Do you see want my bed. These things. Yes. I don't know. Yes. But I had so many Squishmallows that you couldn't even see my bed. And so then I was like, um, this has gotten insane. So I got like body pillows and I stuffed the Squishmallows inside the body pillow. And now my room looks clean again. And I got extra soft pillows. But they're the heaviest pillows you will ever pick up in your entire life. Yeah. <laughs> it's like you throw it at someone and you're going to knock them out. Like, I don't advise it. Someone said, how is Bowie? Bowie is as crazy as ever. Bowie is <laughs> just. He's still, I mean, he's a puppy, right? You can't expect that much. But you know what? He's getting better. He, he is, is getting, getting better. better. It's just the training is taking a long time because. It's not taking that long. He's only a few months old. I'm the only one working on him. Yeah. Like, no one I else. I don't have the heart to do it. <laughs> no one else wants to train the dog and no one else wants to follow my instructions. I was like, don't let, don't pet him when he jumps on you. Don't pet him because that's encouraging that behavior and they I try still my hardest. do it. He's just so cute. Honestly, if I had a dog or on my own, it would be the worst animal on the planet. <laughs> I wouldn't know how to, how to discipline it because it's so cute. Someone says, make a slime dress. I don't even know what a slime dress is. What is a slime? I like, imagine it's like you make a good, like a frame and then you put slime on it and let it harden. But that would be so stiff. Like it wouldn't even. All right. Let me, let me look into that one. Let me look into that. Um, can you make a Baby Yoda inspired room? So, peoples. Hi, Claire. We did make a Yoda inspired room. We reviewed our a whole bunch of different, um, the child type figures. We made a room inspired by the Mandalorian. So when I make rooms, I kind of like wanted it to look like the set sometimes, if your room was on the set. And that's what we did in that video. That video's on YouTube, that my froggy stuff. Do you play piano? No. She could play piano. I could probably be good at instruments if I wanted to. If I had, if I, cause like the amount that I draw, if I spent that same amount of time trying to learn an instrument, I would be good at it. You were good at it. I just can't. She was playing myself. like Gravity Falls on the piano and the opening to the office. Yeah, and yeah, like, I did learn that. And you learned like the Game of Thrones theme, yeah. which is I not just, for kids. One but, of the you know. really hard things about piano is something that I, I have a really hard time doing is the whole isolation of the left hand. Like I can do it on my right hand fine and I can do something on my left hand fine, but doing it diff two different things together, which shouldn't be hard because I played vi violin. Right. So, and that was doing two different things, but excuses I is what I'm hearing. Because it's hard for guitar too. I tried learning some, I did learn one thing on guitar, but excuses. What's up to Sophia? Amazing name, by the way. Um, what is this? Can you, you're making a mini me of articulated Chelsea doll. Congrats. Chelsea is adorable. And I heard that, um, I know that she has a, there's a movie coming out, right? It's Chelsea's Lost Birthday, I want to say on Netflix, right? Um, so we're excited to see that come out. I know there might be toys, but I haven't even gone to look at all for toys. I mean, we've been stuck in the house for a year, so. <laughs> I did venture out the other day. You did? I did, but I didn't go to a store like that. I went, where'd I go? I went to the Dollar Tree and picked up these flowers. So that was today. Yes. <laughs> uh, Someone said, T -t 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 -t. are you going to stay in online school? I'm going back to school next year. Yes. And we're not gonna discuss my feelings about all of that right now. So we're just gonna, Keep going. I prefer not to. So the question, the but. answer is yes, and that's it. <laughs> uh, are you excited for the glow up dolls? I have not heard of the glow up dolls. You're gonna have to. I'm gonna have to Google that after this live and see what that is. Can you make smart doll crafts? I totally have that on my to do list, and stuff just keeps happening. So yes, we can make smart doll crafts. I do have a smart doll video coming up, but it's not a craft video. <laughs> but I do have a smart doll video coming up soon. It's like a smart doll wig haul. Um, so from doll of a kind, I believe. So we're gonna do a video featuring those wigs coming up real soon because you know, wigs are important in the smart doll world. 
it's like a thing. So that video will be coming up real soon. Do you have any remit unboxing videos coming up? I was looking for remit like literally yesterday and I wasn't able to find any. I literally so, love remit. I do too. I literally need to get into a plane and go to Japan and fill up an entire suitcase. That's the only reason why we go. <laughs> that's the only we go. <laughs> no, but that's it's remit. That's not the only reason. It's a beautiful country full of culture and remit. So, um, one of these days. Yes, give me some more time to find the remits because I really, really want them and I'm getting upset that I can't find them. Hey, Angela, how you doing? Can you make a doll grand piano? Yes, actually that has been on my to-do list for quite a while. I've even bought the supplies at one time and then it just didn't happen. So yes, we want to make one. It is definitely something we plan on getting to. So I so said, what, what do you like to do for fun? craft collect dolls <laughs> what about you I don't know sleep <laughs> uh I, also for fun we watch anime I mean that's fun yeah does that count we watch anime every night as a family we watch one episode back what? in the day we used to go out and do stuff you know, but I enjoy the anime movie nights yeah, that we too. do every night. But I will tell you, watching one at a time is Sucks. slightly painful. Incredibly painful. Yeah, because I, I started uh, Kuroko's Basketball while we're watching, and we're watching Fullmetal Alchemist right now. I'm, like, almost done with the anime. <laughs> so And we're, like... Season two? Yes, of Fullmetal Alchemist. Because we watch one episode a day. Yeah. But we're all watching it together. And Fullmetal Alchemist Brotherhood, oh my god. Heartstrings. Is it? It I'm is. Kind of sick of it. So don't ask her. But no, 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 I mean like I love it. I love the fight scenes and I, I the storyline is cool. But God, there's so much crying. It's all the emotional. Time. They're having horrible things happen to them. Hey, bro, and and freaking Attack on Titan horrible things happening to them, and they were crying you, every you, other episode. Are, are you serious? Did you see Aaron? Did you see Aaron? That he cries every single episode. <laughs> every single and then episode. if you look at My Hero Academia, okay, oh Midoriya, Midoriya. <laughs> he gets better though. <laughs> Aaron gets better too. Bro, because we haven't seen season four yet. Aaron's season four uh, is just upgrade. Don't listen, like listen. All right, we're not going down the rabbit hole that is anime right now because it, that will be all this live is about. I think anime. I'm going to start season four because we're trying to wait for you the You can't. You out. have to wait. But I don't want to wait. <laughs> can you make a tubey twist? What is a tubey twist? I don't even know what that is. I don't know what that is. Uh, can you do a mall? So the thing about doing a mall is what do you mean? You have like one giant structure because I like to build things in parts. And so we have done like the shop fronts where you can line them all up and it looks like, you know, you're at like an outdoor mall kind of thing. Um, and we can do shops where they're all individual and then you just put them together because like one giant structure, where would you, where would you store that? Where would you store it? So, I mean, I don't have a place to store that. So as I build buildings and stuff, we kind of comes out looking like a mall when you put them all together. So said, do you play Toka World? Let me tell you about the Toka Boca universe. Used to be obsessed. I just don't. You play. haven't seen it now. Is it crazier? It's it's, it's I used to, like my Sims type seriously? of thing. Seriously? Yeah. Like they've got the thing decorating is that their everything. Their apps all like costed money, so like <laughs> I wouldn't get them a lot of times. But the like that's before you believed in paying for apps. I pay for apps all the time <laughs> now. now. But then you're, back then you were like, why would I pay for an app? Why would I do that? <laughs> Cause that's how you get good apps with no commercial. But um, bro, like Toki took a food and all those sort of things. So I the, did buy the you cooking that. ones. Yeah, I bought you the cooking no, 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 one no. and the hair cutting one. There wasn't those ones. The hair cutting one took a hair salon like took a book of hair salon like three. That one costed money, but the cooking one, the first cooking one, didn't cost any money. But they came out with the second one. That was like way okay, better. Okay, so I know why I didn't. And buy I had to play that on the app store. Cause at the app she store. would lose. A t she would lose interest so fast. I would not. And I would buy these apps, and then she would be like, oh. "It's like, so how are you playing the game?" And then she wouldn't want to play no more. That's and I'm not like, true. I paid nine dollars. I used to be super obsessed with that, so it would have lasted like two years <laughs> at the max. Okay. <laughs> can you do a camp round? Uh, yes, we could totally do a camp round. We actually in our Animal Crossing video. 
it's an Animal Crossing campground kind of sort of. It's like it looks very much like video game ish. But we have made that one. I want to play Animal Crossing so bad. And uh, I was thinking about taking our Animal Crossing craft and making it look more realistic because to me that sounds pretty cool. You know, I so. say I want to play Animal Crossing, but I haven't played Pocket Camp in a few months. I know. When I first got it, I was obsessed with it, but now I like... I've sent you like 10 gifts and you do not send them back. Yeah, it just takes so much time. The friendship is not reciprocated, so reciprocated here. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> uh, can you make an amusement park? So we are working on a carousel right now. We like to build things in pieces. So right now I'm making a carousel for our Barbies and that video should hopefully be out soon. It's taken me a little bit longer than I anticipated, but that video will be the beginning of some amusement park like crafts and we do have several already on youtube we have a ferris wheel we have a fun house we have a concession stand these are some of these are older crafts but you know oh these are goodies you just put your own spin on it and it looks brand new so that's how that works um can you do a hidden doll room pantry yes because i was like wait a minute i just did that no it was a grocery store so i imagine the pantry would be similar to the grocery store just without how then a counter what's up Halvin? how you doing man abby said bella in all caps but yes we can do the pantry because we can totally do that i wanted to make a hidden doll room closet because i don't have enough closets y'all and i guess we can also swap a pantry in that maybe it's like a combo video pantry plus closet because we've done them several times but we're going to do them with the hidden doll room which is like what makes it different <laughs> Uh, so I said, do you like smart, smart dolls? I love smart dolls. I absolutely love my smart dolls. I have a couple of them. I keep eyeing some new ones that I want. They're just so very, very expensive. So I have they do look cool though. I like the ones that don't have noses, or they do have noses, but they don't. You know. Wait. Okay. So there is the anime version, which has no nose. Then there's a semi-real, and then there's the news. I don't know what he's calling the ones with noses, but it's like a subtle nose with nostrils. Do you like the nostrils or no nostrils? You know what? You haven't seen the new ones. It depends ones. because like, it depends. But I know you have a girl, she has like a really, she's dark skin in that one. Coco? Yeah. She, I like her no noseness. That one's cool. No, wait, I, the no nose one I gave away. No, she has a nose, but she does, also doesn't. It's like. Okay. Yeah. Yes. You like the ones without the nostrils. Yeah. Because you haven't seen the ones with nostrils yet. No. I think they're absolutely amazing and I just have to get around to it because that's like... Are uh, they like nostrils nostrils or are they like dots? They're like dots. They're they're adorable and they still look like anime because... I was just wondering because sometimes in anime mock nostrils are like a line. At first when he... At first when the ones came out with the... The first one, the nostrils, I forgot what their names were, Monday, I think, or whatnot. Um, it wasn't exactly, you know, my taste, so I just I just held off. And then he came out with a newer version that's like, oh my goodness, I need them, but they're like, you know, close to $500 a piece. So I have to just hold off for a second. And, uh, you know, 2020, y'all, so. <laughs> Uh, do you watch Free Rain? We watched all of Free Rain. I don't think I made it through the last season, though. No, I was enraged. <laughs> I the, could not watch it. When the ship fell apart, Bella was just like, you know what? I'm, I'm out. No, and then he, that, the Marcus <laughs> got together with that one chick. I was like, I'm not watching this. I cannot. And I hate Zoe. Hey, because she's the main character. <laughs> I know. I, I mean, but it's same you know that show Ginny and Georgia. I didn't watch it. Oh, my God. I can't okay, finish you. it because I hate that girl so much. She's so ungrateful. Okay, okay. <laughs> Stop. We don't hate anyone. Oh, my God. If you watch it, you understand that. Uh, okay. Uh, All right. You love my shirt. Thank you so much, Moonlight Blossom. <laughs> but me and my friends, we go on a group chat, and we're just, like, talking about... Like, I have a friend that watched the whole show. She finished it. I never finished it. And we were just, for probably, like, 15 minutes talking about how much we hated that show. <laughs> how are y'all doing on your flower walls? Are you almost done? The more flowers you can pack into that space, the better. If you feel like you can't cover the whole area, then a good option is to put down, like, a scrapbook paper or a printable to cover up the white space if you don't want to see the white space. I did not do any of those such things. I don't think I have enough flowers to get as full as I want. Someone said, so. do I listen to Astro? I know who they are, 
but I only know who they are because um, cause of the guy from True Beauty is in that, so I looked up the group. I don't listen to them though, but I like the fandom and all that. But yeah. All right, you can see where I'm at so far, destroying my white balance. Or it might be a little better now because it's got color here. But this is where we are so far and I'm still just filling them in. Nope, it destroyed my white balance. Okay, don't forget the bottom. I see lots of gaps in mine. So if you could rename yourself, what would you rename yourself? Uh, my name is kind of perfect for what I do. Yeah. What about, and I used to dislike my name so much because I was teased so much in school about you know, being one of the Jacksons. I'm not a Jackson. My last name isn't even Jackson, but you know, Latoya. Oh, yeah. And then they always called me Latoya Jackson and then I was traumatized as a kid. Um, but now I just go by Toya and I play with toys, so it works. I wouldn't really know what to change my name to. I think I would, yeah. I you didn't yeah. used to get so mad. Why'd you name me Bill? Well, that's because everyone would tell me like, at school, like, oh, your name is white. Okay. Like, okay. Well, let's just, uh, people can be mean. Or, yeah, kids or, suck. Middle school was awful. People like making fun of people yeah. and that's not right. But luckily, high school is a lot better. I don't have to see anybody if I don't want to. Um, so. okay. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, don't listen to the haters. That's right. Would you ever play Royal High? We play was it a game? We do. We have several Royal High videos out there. You know there. what? I feel like that's something that my sister did. They should have made all those like video games, like Sims level video games, or, like Genshin Impact level video games. So you... why wasn't Monster High had? Uh, why didn't Monster High have a Genshin Impact? Sort I, of. I don't like... know what you're talking about. No, you know how it's like super open world, and it's just like you know you have all these characters, and it's just like coolness, you know. Well, but I'm. I thought the question was about Royal High. Oh, Royal High is not <laughs> ever after high. <laughs> no. Uh, yes, we oh have my God. several Royal High videos out there. Uh, we have several Darby Show Roblox videos. Wait, and is that a game? What? Royal High? Yes, a game that you played in and you were in there with me doing Darby Show Roblox. Royal High. Oh, Roblox Royal High. Yes. I was thinking it was something else. I was thinking it was Rainbow High. No. My brain does not work right now. Uh, so, I don't know what is going on. So, uh, yeah, that video, those are out there. And uh, I haven't played it in a while, though. I haven't played it in a minute. Can you do more Disney stuff? We got to be careful with Disney stuff. We'll, we'll come back to that one. We'll come back to that one. Um, you said your flower work looks good. Oh, amazing, Brenda. I'm glad your flower wall is coming along. So what? Earlier today, because I always do a test run before we even go live, I made another flower wall. And at first I wasn't super happy with it, but when I just kept adding more and more flowers to it, it comes out better. So that's why I don't have enough flowers right now for this one. But I'm finding that the more flowers you pack into that space, the the happier I was with the wall, if that makes sense. So said they're watching the remake of Erased. I started Erased. Um, but I didn't like the art style, so I didn't keep watching it. I know it's really good, though. Someone but said... I didn't know there was a remake. Was there a live action? I know there was a live action Death Note by Netflix. I'm not sure why that happened, but... Because <laughs> people want to do what they want, and that's why. And people who will enjoy it will watch it. So that's why. Come on, Netflix. Uh, someone said you should make a Roblox world. So we are. We actually are. And that's uh, the Roblox video that we have coming up. We're actually gonna try to shoot it today, right? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna try to shoot that video today. But we do have a Roblox world that we just created. There's not a lot going on other than walking around because, you know, scripting is difficult and it takes Our time. Our coder is 13. So. Our coder is 13. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he's learning and I, I'm actually really impressed by what he's been able to do so far. So what we have is like you could change your face, you know, and we have, um, well, he made a thing where you can go and change your, this is his map, technically. Um, you can go change your face, and he's been working on this crazy terrain that you can just like walk around and explore. And as we learn more coding slash script or whatever, the game will improve as with most things. So, so. said, Lauren Noodles, I think, said, who is your favorite cosplayer? I don't know if you know who this is, but there's this person called Haken Koser. And basically she does a ton of like anime cosplays and it's absolutely insane. Brain explosion, just like what? 
But yeah, that's a favorite cosplayer. Uh, mine is Tracy J. Hines, because she does all the Disney cosplay stuff, and she sings. And uh, yeah, absolutely love her. And I met her in person, and she's literally a living Disney princess. She was so, so nice the whole time. I don't know if she was just like performing, or if it's like, she kept it up for like a whole eight hours. So <laughs> I was impressed. Uh, do you watch, no, I'm not saying that. Um, do you like the Winx Club series? So are you talking about like the Fate Saga? Cause I've watched the Fate Saga. I've only seen a couple episodes of Winx when it was the cartoon. And I don't remember much from so it. So I said, do you watch Falcon Winter Soldier? Yes. Yes. And I'm obsessed with it. I started the new episode uh, today. Literally, like what? The thing is, I didn't finish um, uh, one division. I need to, because I know it all ties together. So I need to finish that. I'm it does so, tie into WandaVision? No, not yet, but it has to, Because right? I thought they released them in different orders than what they were supposed to originally been released in. But Loki, I'm like so ready for that. So ready for that. Like, hurry up. Uh, can you make Barbie teddy bears? I think we can. That, like if you want to hand sew a teddy bear, because there's, there's like that pom-pom trick where you can glue pom-poms together. My teddy bears were never cute with the pom-pom teddy bear trick. But if you want to like hand sew a handmade teddy bear for a Barbie, we can definitely try to do that. That's going to take me a little time to figure out a pattern. Um, we have done like full cloth or fabric dolls. So I guess it would just be similar just in a bear. Like just so is it, what is your favorite and least favorite season? What? My favorite season is summer. Okay. Because it's summer, like duh. And But then least favorite is... You're destroying stuff here. Winter, I guess. I just hate being cold. I love winter because there is no bugs. Yeah, well, I also hate spring because like... <laughs> I like Jesus. spring in theory, I but... Know, we lived in Kansas. I hated spring because spring was tornado season and I was like, oh my gosh. Was it spring? Happen. Yeah, spring tornado, was tornado that, that tornado came through and tore up our fence. Yeah. I remember yeah. a gas station got demolished. I remember and going back to school the next day and everyone talking about like, did you hear the tornado yesterday? There was a tornado yesterday. Well, we were living in Kansas, man. Yeah. So, <laughs> um, thank goodness we were okay. I remember this kid talking about like, uh, I remember him saying, my mom woke me up at like 3 a.m. because there was a tornado outside and we were going crazy. We were like fifth, not fifth grade. I did. Like one night like, we literally had a, grade. we had to stay like the entire night in a bathroom in the yeah, basement. Yeah, in the basement. Because uh, there was a tornado. It's like, this thing could just come and rip our house apart and can do nothing about it. Unfortunately, some people like, weren't so fortunate. They geez. were, they did lose their homes. Yeah, there was like a, it was like a, and that was like so common there. Uh, I remember them talking about Oklahoma too, that happens there. Um, it says, I don't know what that means. Do you watch Mo Little Witch Academia? I have not, but I'm obsessed with the art style, but um, I haven't watched it. Uh, and then someone said, what are you going to do? Are you going to do anything for Miraculous Season 4? So, I haven't been up to date. I am so behind on everything that is Miraculous. I think I only ever watched Season 1 and part of Season 2. I will look for the dolls. Because I know there's dolls. And I know they're supposed to be, like, really cool. And I uh, just got to give me some time to get those. Because I live in an area that does not have new toys ever and for some reason when i shop online lately everything is sold out barbies x zara so uh yeah we're working on that <laughs> um someone said they love frog food thank you and i think that person has yeah that person has a uh an attack on titan manga person on their thing yeah thank you anime people i have another one coming out what is it today well did they ever do my april video you did a video recently the sailor moon one yes that was april right no what month is it it's april then yes okay <laughs> <laughs> next um, one will be tutorial can you make a doll alarm clock yeah i think a doll alarm clock sounds pretty easy i don't i think we can totally do that i'm kind of in love with the retro old-fashioned alarm clocks not the ones with the like the circle with the little bells on the side but more like it's like brown and this is hard to explain it's a clock but <laughs> there's one in our snoopy monochromatic room and there's a little alarm clock and i want to remake that i want to say it's an alarm clock but watch it be a radio wait you mean like the circle ones it wasn't a circle it was like a like a, a rounded 
a rectangle is rounded on the corners. I could be wrong. I could be making all of this up. My ima <laughs> it's all in my imagination. I dreamed it. Who knows? But uh, I will go back and look. And if we can make that alarm clock that I think I'm thinking of, we will totally get that done. So said, how old is Bowie? Old enough to know. Old enough to think for himself. <laughs> that's that's for sure. Old enough to know that he doesn't what he wants and what he doesn't want to do. But he was born in July. So how many months is that? I don't know. Too many. Uh, okay, July, uh, July. He was born at the beginning of July. So yeah. July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February, March. We're in April now, mm -hmm. past the ninth. So he's 10 months old. Wow, really? Yeah. He's almost a year. And he's acting like he's three months old. Oh my God. And actually he's not. Three I months know. Old was really bad. Because he sleeps through the night now. Yeah, he's not like, you know. He hasn't had an accident in the Biting house our fingers. In like a, a while. He does bite my ankles. His top but... teeth, his canines on the top are so sharp. I don't know why. I got cut, literally. It's like he just, yeah. he's trying to be nice and he slices your finger open and you're like, what? But he, he has this thing where like, he just runs around the house. It's called the zoomies. Yeah, he just sprints around the house just for like, it lasts like five minutes. And or when he tries to like rub himself into the carpet. After you wash him. Yeah. Yeah. That's actually kind of hilarious to watch. Or after he um gets, or like if it's, if it's raining outside and we took him out. Then he just, <laughs> he rubs himself into the carpet trying to get it off. Reminds me of like when you wash a horse and they roll. Yes. Yeah. But only difference is there's no mud there. Okay, I have run out of flowers. Did not prepare adequately. I didn't have enough flowers. But white balance, this is what we have so far. So this wall is all pretty much like pink and purpley colors. Very, very spring, very happy. I did not cover my edges adequately. You do want to cover all of your edges, but uh, uh, ha, ha, we do have one that we finished earlier. This one has a little bit more blue in it, and I feel like we packed the flowers in really well. And what you can do with the flower wall is not only just take photos in front of it, like you have your doll standing in front, it creates a really nice backdrop for photography, but you can also use it in your doll rooms, like uh, put it behind a couch, or uh, like, you know, by a table, you can use it in the decor. So I'm excited to do some photos with that. I am out of flowers now, so I guess my project was done. How long did that take me? 36 minutes. Not bad, man. Yeah. Not bad. Can you make a seven quick crafts video using the wedges from the mini brands balls? Seven different ways to use the wedges. You have to let me think on that. We have done some videos in the past using the wedges. So we, in one of our earlier mini brands video, we put them on some wooden dowels and made like a shelf type of thing for a grocery store. And in our doll organization video, we have them on a cork board and we keep like push pins and paper clips in them. I actually use that all the time right now, like on a daily basis. That is what I use. Um, can you make an anime room? That is on the to-do list. I kind of looking for an original anime, so. What? For my anime room, I want original anime art. I mean. So I'm waiting on my anime artist do to you want uh, brand give me some stuff, stuff. Or do you want like, can you take stuff I've already done? I can totally use stuff you've already done. Okay. Yeah, so, but I want more stuff. So, <laughs> uh, that's what we're working on with that. Let me see this, because I did write down some of the YouTube questions and you're not even answering I mean, answering you would need them. like, you would need like posters, right? And then you would also need like a uh, sketchbook, like things that they've done. Okay. To go on a desk. Well, that's easy, because I can just take your artwork and shrink it down to make a uh, thing for that. Make a iMac. Yes, that's actually pretty easy. Someone said, are you guys good at telling jokes? I don't know. No, negative. I, it, it always comes out awkward and wrong, so no, I don't tell jokes. Yeah, I'm not good at telling jokes, but I am good at making fun of things. There's a difference. Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can you make a campsite? Yes, Camilla, that is on the list. And you can also check out our Animal Crossing campsite on YouTube right now. Um, can you make, I don't know what that is, Camp Cretaceous toys. I'm guessing those are, <laughs> dinosaurs of some sort Cretaceous. I'll have to look into that because I'm not familiar with it. Um, can you, are you going to make any more custom doll content? Yeah, of course. Um, I just don't do it often. 
I'm not gonna lie. I don't do it often. So it's like you do another updated or extreme makeover doll series. I have to have something to extremely make over in order to do that. And so I have to look through my stuff and see what we haven't been using and that is ready to be repurposed. So you gotta give me some time on that one. As for the custom dolls, I do want to, I have to remake Toya, mini Toya, cause I want her hair to be shorter and I want her to have some grays. Cause I'm embracing the grays, man. So that video, will that be a video or will I just do it? I don't so know. is your coder Noah? He is. Yes. Yeah. He yes. cannot code yet, but he's learning. He's, he's got learning. a couple things. He knows he, more than I do. Yeah, he's done. A, he can make them sit on things. He did that, and he did the the face changer. Yeah, he did that. So um, he he did build the whole map. Yes, he did. Yeah. it's his map. It's it, it's literally by the real Froggy Boy. He's the map creator. It's his map. Um, he's just making it. So just give us some time, and we'll get more things add it to well he'll get more things added to it as honestly though i think by 15 he'll be able to do a ton of stuff uh probably by the summer i'm putting him in that class oh yeah that summer. too yeah um if you had if you could have any of your doll builds in real life what would it be and why like if we can literally live in one of our doll rooms which one would you want the studio apartment the yellow one that we just did yeah that one was pretty cool. I actually really love that one. It's you one should of make my a better ones. House. Just imagine it's on the top of a building. Done. I mean, but it should be <laughs> huge. You should make a big. We're, yes. Okay. Let's go ahead and do that. I don't need to walk in my studio. <laughs> we'll just build everything so big. <laughs> um, yeah, but a penthouse would literally be the exact any room, which is at the top of your fictitious building. So, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, <laughs> so you would love to live in the studio apartment. It's actually one of my favorites too. I like the studio apartment. Yeah. So it's nice and modern. It is. Yeah. I did it. I did a pretty decent job on that one. Uh, when will you upload the next summer in Cali? So summer in Cali, we, we get those out roughly once a month. Actually we have, we've done one every month. One month we did summer Cali explain. So it wasn't a part of the storyline, but it was to help explain why things are the way they are but last month or this month was it this month or last month it was this month we put one out and that was summer and cali what was the name of that writer's block we put that one out so the next one is going to be due next month because that's how we've been able to schedule them and if you think about it most tv series are 12 to 13 episodes now so if we're doing one a month that is 12 a year yeah. We're doing it. It works, right? <laughs> they take a long time to edit. It's the longest video we have to edit. It's the longest video to prep for. And uh, shooting's not that bad. Usually shooting takes about two days, roughly. But summer calories are intense. They're intense because we also have to go back to the, some of the older summer calories and make sure we got like our stuff straight, like our facts right. So that's the reason why right now they're they're once a month, just because there's just so much information. There's so much going on. Someone said, who is Bowie? Bowie is our crazy dog. Yes, yeah. Mr. Bowie. Um, shout out to Tara Lynn. What's up? Someone it's probably said, Tara. Is it Tara Lynn or Tara Lynn? I don't know. There's, someone said they're obsessed with Miraculous. I heard Miraculous actually has an anime, or there's an anime sort of, I don't know if it's fan made or something, but there's like an anime. Like a book? No. No, that's a manga. Anime. Man. I thought it is like a, I don't know if there's an anime version. I, I thought mean, I it saw, was just Miraculous. I saw something on TikTok and it was like anime Miraculous. Oh, well, if that's more appealing to you, go look it for it. It looks super, super cool. I just have to get around to it. I, I really like the first season. And, uh, but you know, that's me though. I taper off a lot after one or two seasons. Yeah, it's cause like you watch something and you're obsessed with it, but then you have to wait for the next season and then you kind of don't care about it. That's time. exactly what happens. So it's always best for me to watch a series after it's ended. Yeah. Even that doesn't work for me sometimes. I, <laughs> for Vampire Diaries, I haven't finished it and I started don't it. Don't talk to me. Six times. I don't know her. I I'm not with why. her. Cause Vampire Diaries, I watched every single episode. I've seen it like three times. And I recently just saw there was a Vampire Diaries Legacies on Roblox. I haven't checked it out on yet. On Roblox? I know. I'm about to go walk through Mystic Falls, y'all. You can find anything on Roblox. Like, there's literally <laughs> anything. Yeah, Noah was playing Attack on Titan the other day in Roblox, and it was so creepy. It was so creepy. So, so do you have a favorite Bollywood movie or Bollywood actor? 
Uh, no. I don't really watch a ton of Bollywood. The closest I've ever gotten to like watching a Bollywood film, I am very much ashamed, ashamed to say, is uh, Bride and Prejudice. It was like we a Pride and Prejudice something. remake. We did watch something. We did start one. We did start one. I don't know the name of it. Me neither. There was something about a motorcycle and a wedding planner. Yeah, yeah there was, was a wedding planner. I don't remember what it was. I will say the, the the dance numbers come out of nowhere. It's just all of and a sudden. Mess. Everyone's dancing. It's like it's beautiful. Um, but yeah, so Bride and Prejudice is the closest thing I've gotten to like watching a, a film all the way through. So yeah. Um, can you make Cabbage Patch Kid themed room if you haven't already? I haven't made a Cabbage Patch Kids room. We have done Cabbage Patch Kids videos, especially the new little tiny ones, because like the bigger Cabbage Patch, you know, it's just, it's not really my size. You should make an Apple store. Yes. It's literally a white room with a couple of phones. That's genius. Easy peasy. And done. The, and the, they got the, the counter. Oh, I got a counter in the middle. Yeah. Then you just load it with as many dolls as you can. You just pack all the dolls into that one little room. Put one dude in the middle with like a blue shirt on that nobody can talk to because he's already talking to somebody else. And all the dolls have to wait. Yeah. <laughs> I am not bashing Apple right now. <laughs> I don't know if this is real, but I saw something where like somebody had... I don't remember if it's actually something that happened, but something about like someone set the alarms to every single phone in the Apple store and then they all went off. Why would they do that? I don't know, but it was hilarious. Okay. My experience with Apple stores is just standing around waiting. I'm not gonna, <laughs> like, I mean, that was like a while back. Maybe it's different now, you know? My experience is going in and downloading and changing all the, and changing all the, um, the phones, the to my wallpapers. Stuff? To BTS. Oh, so and then... Dude, you're you supposed to push us! And then when you leave, you put all the phones on YouTube on Tafari stuff. Oh, Every time, now she I remember that. back when we were in Target, when like we went to what we went places, and you go to Target, and you pass the phones. <laughs> okay, yes. And you change them to I am stuff. guilty of that. I yeah. go to Target, and I change the phones to my froggy stuff YouTube, Watch and that I walk be away. A felony, and we just admitted to... I admit crime. nothing. I did nothing of that sort. That was a dream. Okay. <laughs> Can you make a baby room or nursery? We have, we have a baby room slash nursery inspired by Toy Story 4. That video is on YouTube. The crib actually turns from a crib into a toddler bed. So that video is out there. You should check it out. So said that that's my drawings. Thank you. I like your profile picture too. I don't remember your name, but I remember seeing your profile picture. Um, so. Next question is, who is your favorite YouTuber? Like, Workout videos. Oh, in love with Jazzercise right now, man. Yeah, Jazzercise. literally. And like from the OG lady, from the lady that like created it. What are you doing? What? You're making a mess. I'm not doing. You didn't use these. Oh, I'll get that. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I also really like Tiffany Roth workouts, Tracy J. Hines. So, those are like my favorite YouTubers. Tracy's just amazing because, you know, she has like the most gorgeous dresses. And then uh, Tiffany Roth, you know, helps me stay in shape. So I watch Ergo Josh and Yona Yama Mai, uh, and forgot the other person's name. But yeah. <laughs> uh, can you make a horse stable? We do. We have a video for a horse stable, and I believe we have briars in it. That video is on YouTube. We also made a tack room, and we made a wash stall. So those videos are out there. Someone said, "What's your favorite glasses you've ever had?" My favorite glasses. I would say these. Uh, I liked my bigger ones better, I think. Uh, these are just- The gold ones? Yeah. I didn't like those on my face. These are just easier. I don't know. I, I don't feel like I'm gonna break these. So I Yeah, and they're the just easier and sturdier. And... and they have that blue light vision yeah, stuff yeah, that too. in them. So that's what I've been doing. Do you read webtoons? Uh, off and on. Not webtoons from webtoon. But yeah. <laughs> Uh, I have not read them. I've seen the commercials and I find the commercials intriguing. And then she told me the commercials are not like the actual webtoons. So, I mean, they are, but they're, the commercials are like uh, like animations and stuff. Yeah, that's but, what I thought I was getting, but apparently oh, not. Oh, no. I was them. like, they're going to read to me in this voice? <laughs> no. Like that one commercial for webtoons. I was like, man, this guy reads great. And then, no, you actually have to read it yourself. It's a comic book. Yeah. So, hmm. Uh, <laughs> Uh, what's the latest movie I've watched? The last movie I watched, I attempted Thunder Force. What's that? I, 
it was like Ghostbusters with superheroes. Oh, so, that, 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 that. Yeah. I don't, I didn't finish. But I did start Thunder Force, and then I was like, uh, I'm going to go watch Star Trek. So that's right, The happened. last movie I watched was actually, what's it, guys? Michael Cera? You know who that is? No. Oh, he's a comedian. It was, it's, uh, it was, I forgot what his name, the name of the movie, but something about, like, it had Michael Cera in it. And it had Chris Evans in it. And it was on Netflix. And I was just, inst- I, saw, I couldn't finish it. It was so crazy. But it was funny, though. There you go. It was a little weird. I think I watch more TV series than I do movies. Me too. I watch a lot more TV than I watch movies. Um, it says, "What? how do you get ideas for your dolls? So, like, a lot of times it's what's popular, what's trending. We will definitely dabble in whatever is trending. Then I look at fashion magazines a lot or look at what's in the stores. I used to, back in the day, when I would walk the malls and go into, like, the fashion stores, like Forever 21 and stuff like that and see what they had. And that's what inspired my fashion. Back in the day. Um, and I would also go to Ikea a lot. 2019. Said, yeah, Ikea. Those are fantastic. Uh, over the last year, I've been focusing on what's around me. And so some of the crafts will be inspired by things around my house or how I wish my house would be done. So that's pretty much where a lot of the inspiration comes. Can you do a craft based off the crown? I feel like the crown, ah. the, the hype around it kind of died down a little bit. Well, it's not, I don't know. It's just, that's. What like, would you do? Would you make the crown? I, I don't know because I feel like that's kind of a sensitive thing. I, I yeah, it's do. not like Game of Thrones, how like because it's like a real family, and and for me, I don't you know what I'm saying like I feel like that might be intrusive yeah. a little bit personally. I, I, that's I just feel me. like the crown is like. Oh, it's just kind of insane. But see, it? like, if it was like Princess Diaries, they were talking about Genovia, which doesn't yeah, exist. Yeah. Then yeah, I'm like, okay, it doesn't exist. We're not talking about real people. But with the with the crown, those are actual real people with their real lives, and you know, I don't know. That feels a lot. It feels worse. Weird still alive to me. So so. Um, how long do you spend in the craft room a day? <laughs> Sophia, my life. Um, <laughs> I'll go down into the basement or slash craft room um, at about 10, sometimes 9.30. Today I got down there at like 9.30. Um, and then I will leave around 10.30, 11. It's supposed to be 10.30. My New Year's resolution was to leave at 10.30 so I wouldn't be down there longer than like 12 hours. But sometimes I'll be down there and I don't even realize it and time just passes and they say, you know, it's like one o'clock in the morning. So that's happened a few times. Someone said, do your friends watch me for my furry stuff? Um, I mean, no. I don't expect them to, though. But It's messed up, man. I, I mean, know who you I are. expect them to. I know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> I, just, <laughs> um, I mean, I don't know. I, I don't know, because sometimes I'll have done a live, and then I go to the group chat, and there's, like, like screenshots of me. They've taken of me mid-talking, and I'm just like, what the heck? Oh. Bella is the best person in the world to take screenshots of while she's talking. No, because on my frog foods, I get so animated and oh, it's awful. It's my favorite thing. So, like, I'll look at her, I'll take <laughs> screenshots, and half time she's like... Ugh. It's, just so, it's just like, oh my goodness, this is, like, the best. And that's what I do all the time, is take screenshots of Bella, too. Um, shout out to SS Spirit. What's up? says quick question can you make more sheets and beds and pillows with a room yeah i believe we've been doing sheets a lot with our our rooms so yeah we can totally add the sheets to the bedding i don't really do fitted sheets as much because it's just you know more work you gotta sew those corners and make it boxy and all that but yes we can definitely add uh the do that um shout out to rs no srx What's up? Can and you make a doll down. room inspired by Pop Steiner from Riverdale? Do you remember what it looked like? I do not. You know, the story of Riverdale, the, the arc of Riverdale has taken a turn. I haven't really been watching it, but I've been watching the crack videos of Riverdale, and wow. We, they're really I will, doing something. Classic diner type thing. Yeah, we I can think totally cool, though, do that. Neat. I think it's like red and chrome and booths type of thing. Things so. like red, pink, and white, and blue. No. Riverdale's so dark. I don't understand you see any colors. Like, they keep the camera lit, like, super dark. Most of like Sabrina. Everything's always dark. Um, I can totally look into that. Can you Maybe make... something from Sabrina. Dude, I love Sabrina. I think that's... 
Sabrina came to an end, though. And I kind of feel like Sabrina's more of a Halloween type of vibe. So we could definitely revisit that idea. Um, can you make a BTS room? We did! We, I think we have like two yeah. BTS rooms out there. We, we've done a couple of them. I did one inspired by the music video Idol, where you see like the cloudy rainbow colors all over the walls then we just did like a bts fan room for chloe's room uh back in the day so yeah that is definitely out there uh, when did you become a youtuber i've been doing youtube since 2010. that's why a lot of times if you look at i'm sorry that was really loud that's why a lot of times if you look at our doll houses like the number on the house would be 2010 or on like mailboxes and stuff because that's the year we started little tip we picked up from Barbie since they put 59 on everything. Favorite character in Attack on Titan? Mikasa. Mikasa. Levi. Hanji. Yeah. I like Aaron. I know that's a sensitive subject. People hate Aaron. I like Aaron. Armin? Oh my god. I love Armin. Jean? I don't like Sasha. I like uh, Jean a lot. Oh my god. I forgot about him. I actually love him. Like... Sasha's okay. She's like really good at what she does. Like, yeah, yeah, she's yeah. She's like an amazing with tracker it's and bow and arrow and all that. Annoying. Sometimes. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, and Annie. I like Annie. I shouldn't, but I do. <laughs> <laughs> I like Rhino. No. You like Rhino? No. I was, I was like, no. I was like, you no. said you like Annie? That's literally no. saying I like Rhino. I hate Rhino and Jared's old. <laughs> <laughs> I hate them. <laughs> okay. Oh, boy. All right. Uh, shout out to the... Um, Technical booster vision. What's up? Uh, are we doing shoutouts? Uh, I'm going to just go ahead. Actually, yeah, we're actually at that point. Um, shout out to, this is a long one. Hold on. Lucy, Bella, Ophelia, Ruby, and Jesse. What's up? <sighs> shout out to Tara Lynn. What's up? Shout out to Chloe Kim. What's up? Shout out to, um... Sophia, what's up? Shout out to Crazy Creative Mom, what's up? Uh, Cupcake25, what's up? Shout out to Wirefly Creates, what's up? Lexi Rose, what's up? Shout out to Pikachu Lover, what's up? Peyton240, what's up? Shout out to Crazy Audrey, what's up? The Radical Rainbow, what's up? Shout out to Emma. What's up? DJ, what's up? Shout out to DG. What's up? Oh, it was DG. I said DG, but I said DJ. Oh my god. That's okay. I got you covered. Laura man. Noodles. What's up? Shout out to Maddie Plays. What's up? Barbara Roberts. What's up? Connie Codwell. What's up? Um, Scrooge McDuck 2004. What's up? Uh, Brent Godfrey. What's up? Come on, man. You're messing it Mara up. Mara Roy. <laughs> what's up? Sage. What's up? Um, XJ. The Toy Show. What's up? XJ Love. What's up? Two more. Camilla. What's up? And one more from me, Bliss Stable. What's up? Thank you so much for joining us this week on YouTube Live with Toya and Bella while we made wallflowers. There are flower walls. Yeah, I was like, wow, wallflowers. It's like a whole thing, but it's really a wallflower. No, it's flower walls. The flower wall. Yes. Which are technically wallflowers. No, they're not. Because <laughs> wallflowers... I know what the real word is. I just was playing around with No, it. I'm saying... A wallflower is a person who stands on the wall. No, that's what I'm saying. I'm saying a flower wall cannot be a wallflower. <sighs> While we made flower walls. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there we go. This is a pretty fun crab. If you keep it nice and thin, it'll be easy to store. You can make more than one, combine them together, take lots and lots of photos. Your dolls will love it. Place it behind your couch, whatever you like. We can't wait to see them on Instagram. If you did make one today and you would like to show us, use hashtag MyFroggyStuffFanPics and we will be able to see that if you have a public account. Thank you all for joining us. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell. Follow us on Instagram at my froggy stuff the frog vlog and her over there at bella of my froggy stuff you can check out bowie on the frog vlog and we have a new video coming for you 
Well, ran out of breath. And we have a new video coming out for all of you tomorrow at noon. It is Barnes & Noble Fun Finds. So be sure to check that out at noon Eastern Standard Time. Thank you all for joining us. We love you.